families visiting one of the most popular Christmas light displays in Minnesota had a scare they'll never forget. It happened last night at the Celebrate the Light of the World event in Wilmer. Investigators say horses were pulling a carriage with more than a dozen kids and parents when the animals suddenly got spooked. The horses pulled the wagon off the property down a road before crashing into a pole of a basketball hoop in a driveway. The wagon's driver was knocked out, landing him in the hospital in critical condition. WCCO's Jeff Wagner talked with a family that was on board during the terrifying trip. It's a Christmas tradition that shines bright in Wilmer every winter. We've been doing it out there for the last three, four years. Alan Setrum and his son Ashton couldn't wait to visit the famous display at Celebrate the Light of the World. But rather than riding in a car, they hopped into a horse-drawn carriage. It wasn't even five, ten feet into the ride that you could tell that there was something wrong with the horses. Setrum says the horses sped off of the property and started down County Road 9. He says the animals wouldn't listen to the driver's commands. As the ride went along, as we went further down the road, you know, panic was really kind of starting to set in with everybody that was in there. He says the driver did his best to control the horses, but that they took a sharp turn down a driveway, crashing into a basketball hoop. And the canopy come crashing down. That's when I noticed the driver was no longer up front. The driver was knocked out. The horses went back out into the road until a driver in a truck pulled up in front of them, stopping the scary ride. And to have something like this happen, it, it, our hearts and our our prayers certainly go out to the family. Jeffrey DeMars is with the Salvation Army, the charity that gets donations thanks to the display. He says the driver also suffered a heart attack sometime during the ride. Obviously, people come out here to celebrate the lights, so to have something like this happen, all of our focus now is on those families and their recovery. That's where Setrum's focus is, too, and he hopes to have a chance to tell the driver thank you. If he wouldn't have been up front controlling them through that first part when we went through the ditch in the first corner and, and up through the, the light display with all the people around that who knows what happened. Jeff Wagner, WCCO 4 News. The display shut down after the incident last night, but organizers tell us they were back on tonight because family members of the driver feel that's what he would have wanted. The driver, again, most currently, most recently listed in critical condition at Hennepin County Medical Center.